than before. Much stronger. We're close. We must be. Our moment of triumph draws closer. Our enemies will paint us with bruises, and we will wear them with pride. You are my today, and should fate will it, my tomorrow. I am iron, steel, and silver. I am our mother's blade, Chmar Salar Gith. I am. Never again will our people suffer under a lithid enslavement. Zai, Zai, Zai! Honestly, I was expecting an all-powerful brain to have a lair that was a little uh, flashier. Not immaculately designed or anything, just to have a sense of drama to it. Oh, as well as can be expected when facing down the end of the world. <laughs> Please, darling. You have the vampire ascendant on your side. How could we lose? Can't afford to stay idle.
trap. the beast. The sooner we kill this thing, the better. Honestly, I think self-reflection may be the enemy just now. I can't afford to lose my nerve. Safer to just not think and keep forging ahead. I do. Think of all we've been through just to get to this moment. That wasn't luck. That was us. Let's just stay shoulder to shoulder and see this through. silence. The air is stale and putrid. It's close. Have the stones ready. Your blood slows. Your senses strung so tight they could snap in an instant.
You think you know why you are here? Listen to it. Use the stones. Freedom. 
of the crown has caused it to evolve. It has become something more. A nether brain. I was as surprised as you were. 
It has been anticipating our every move from the start. I underestimated it. We will need to rethink our plan. There I was thinking we were finally about to put an end to all of this. Too good to be true, I suppose. All of that? And the stones didn't even work? I swear, this is never ending. The Netherbrain believes it will rise victorious. But it could never predict the extent of our might and the strength of our bond. But first, we must attend to the captive prince. Let there be no doubt. We will take the hammer, and we will free Orpheus. The prince of the comet will soar, and the age of Vlaketh will be ended. He will suffer no longer. The true heir Orpheus will destroy the Lich Queen and show my people true ascension. Watch your back. Well, that ends not as bad as it could have. have assessed our encounter with the Netherbrain from every angle. I know why we failed. The problem was not the stones. The problem was you. You can make only one move at a time, but the Netherbrain calculates every possible move at once. It knows what you will do. It knows everything you could possibly do. You cannot outmaneuver it. To defeat it, you would have to think like an Anithid. Better yet, be one. 
Your mind is not capable of this. Mine is. You will give the stones to me. I will assimilate Orpheus, and then I will be able to leave this prison to face the brain. Assimilate him? Skva! No! Now is the time to liberate him! Do not stand against me. I will consume his thoughts, his knowledge, his brain. So you would kill him? He is Gith's heir. You'd be your own people's betrayer. You'd be my betrayer. I realize he is of some significance to you. But he is of even more value to our cause. You still don't trust me. After all we've been through, remember, I have been your salvation from the very beginning. Your knight in shining armor. I freed you from the Nautiloid. Prevented you from crashing to your death. I have protected you ever since. At no small cost to myself. I came to you as a leader. But I did not shy away from showing you vulnerability. I needed you as much as you needed me. I was not above recognizing this. When you discovered my true identity, I did not flinch from the truth. I never lied to you, not once. I am just like you. We have the same enemy, the same story. I encouraged you to fulfill your potential, all while protecting you from harm. Now I ask you for the last time to trust me. Release the Netherstones to me. everything I've done for you. I thought you understood the value of your freedom when you destroyed the contract that bound you to deliver the crown. But now you insist on freeing the Gith Yankee and risking everything we work towards. I told you the Gith Yankee would only want to kill you for what you are. Still, you choose to break our alliance. I had hoped for better. But I can't say I'm surprised. It was always in your nature to give in to temptation. Very well. Since you will not work with me, you work against me. You leave me no option but to join the Netherbrain. with the hammer and free the prince of the comet. Gith's beloved son will lead us to a sure victory against the Netherbrain. His eyes are unseeing, his voice silenced. But even with his mind caged, you can feel his power.
the Yankee prince takes his blade, a silent cry pierces your head. A psionic scream to the astral plane. You reek of illithid. You stole an unborn hatchling from your own people. And you slaughtered my honor guard. Nonetheless, it seems we must be allies. Your Majesty, the Prince of the Comet gives true heir. It is an honor. Do not patronize me. You rejected the Illithid when it no longer suited your needs. No doubt you freed me because it suits you now. I will neither forgive nor forget your abuse of my powers. That is false. You had the opportunity to surrender yourself to my honor guard. They would have given you a noble end. Any worthy individual destined to become Gage would have done so. My guard would have freed me, and I would have stopped the Elder Brain before it evolved into a Nether Brain. All that suffering... avoidable. Were it not for the choices you made! about one thing. The Netherbrain's power is beyond us. The hardest metal in the world would not cut through its mind, for it is made of thought itself. At this point, it will take an Elithid to unleash the full potential of the Netherstones. is already foretold. This is the only way to stop the grand design. Whatever prevents you from doing what is necessary, face it. Overcome it. Return to me when you are ready to transform. an ideal place to chat, but I'll allow it. Oh, as well as can be expected when facing down the end of the world. Finally, about to put an end to all of this. Too good to be true, I suppose. I trust you have weighed your options and reached the only honorable conclusion. Are you ready to transform? It seems I misjudged you. You are capable of sacrifice. The Netherbrain wants nothing more than to see all infected become geek. My defenses keep the voice of the Absolute out. But just as I can raise them, so I can lower them. I will allow the voice of the Absolute in. Once it reaches you, it will order you to transform. It will only take a moment. And once you are a Mind Flayer, I will fold you under my protection once more. You will be the savior of empires. Not least, my own. With the withdrawal of Orpheus's power, your mind is rushed with the full force of the Netherbrain. You feel a compulsion unlike anything you've ever known. It's excruciating and exhilarating in equal measure. You wish nothing in the world but to evolve. Then, complete silence. A 
as you are once again closed off from the Netherbrain's mine. Our people will remember you. The rebel Illithid who stood beside their reborn prince and ended the grand design. Let us return now to the city and follow the path of the Netherbrain. I think my last meal is threatening Come. to resurface. It's time for a most noble sacrifice. Gifts blessings upon you. Rest still. I think we're done here. I'll certainly be glad to see the back of it anyway. I will not forget what you did here today. Nor will the Githyanki people. We have unchained the truth. First, he will lead us to victory against the Netherbrain. Then, he will loose the Githyanki from Vlakit's undead talons. I, I can't talk when we have a city to save, darling. At least the bits of it that are worth saving. <laughs> Concentration of combatants here. The brain must be close. I always dreamed of walking these halls, you know. Enjoying the luxury of the Ducal Palace. And look at it now. <laughs> I admit, I'm a little tall. You are repulsive. But just think of all the power you can access. It's a compelling mixture in an ally. High Hall. There's nowhere else to go. This is where it all ends. Of course. You look different, there's no denying that. But I think you're still the same, deep down. You're doing what's necessary, for all of us. That's why I've been by your side this whole time. Such blazing wonder, to stand together and behold the sky swarming with red dragons. They may roar Vlacket's name, but I can't deny their beauty. For this one moment, in this one battle, the Lich Queen and I share a common cause. The Netherbrain's defeat, and the Grand Design's failure. My instinct is to flay you where you stand. But I am more than my instinct. You made an incredible sacrifice. For me, for our people, for the Prince of the Comet. I know who you are. And I know what you gave up. 
You are the source of my bruises, the source of my joy, and more still. You are Mlagi, Liberator. Concentration of combatants here. The brain must be close. The Prince of the Comet has come! Shabar Orpheus! Shabar Orpheus! Shabar! Orpheus! Vos, my most loyal friend. How good to set eyes on you. You honor me. Your radiance. A geish keeps you company. Unusual. An illithid in guise. An old ally in truth. She took this form so I might end the grand design. Skva! Can it be? Thanks to you. The skies above Tunarath shall tremble with psalms. Orpheus will take the truth to the people. We will slay the Lich Queen. Our chains will be cleaved. Mighty Foss, your words lift me. Vlaketh will splinter like glass and vanish like smoke. Shavar, Orpheus! The Githyanki Empire is stronger with a free people. What use is a mighty dragon if you severed its wings? The Queen will have her due in time. Today, we strike at the brain. This champion holds the key to its defeat. Stand by for orders, Voss. Answer to her as you would answer to me. As you wish, Prince Orpheus. Forward! The nether brain falls this day! Let it be the first victim in the war for the skies! lost much already, and we will lose more before the day is out. But even when the last soul falls, Baldur's Gate will stand. For Baldur's Gate is more than just a city. It is more than a place of opportunity for those of mercantile spirit. More than a place of refuge for those who are lost. More than a home for friends, loved ones, and adventuring souls. Baldur's Gate is a place where anyone can find what they need, if they're just willing to fight for it. Today, Baldur's Gate needs us. Today, we fight for... Your late friend? This is the one you spoke of. The very same. The champion we've been waiting for. The one who will save Baldur's Gate from ruin. The fist eyes you with suspicion. 
He was not expecting the savior of Baldur's Gate to be a mind flayer. Appearances may change, but they do not mask the one within. This one, I know. Observe with whom it traveleth, friends. This mind flare will fight with thee. It will save thy city and thy lives. The fist's suspicion softens to curiosity, his hostility melting at the recognition that there's more behind those eyes than malice. My steel is yours, mind flare. And I'm not alone. Never thought I'd be fighting alongside a mind flayer. But I'll fight with you. With magic. I'm better at crafting steel than wielding it. Your friend here is armored and potion-fueled and ready for battle. I have marshaled the best the Flaming Fist has to offer. We will fight to the last. My Iron Hand gnomes brought enough explosives to level the upper city. Just show us where we're needed. The Moon Maiden's silver light is a shield in dark times. Today, it is mine to wield. And I hold her sword. Whatever strength I have to lend, I will lend it. I will make my city proud again. You carried me once, friend. And now, I'll carry you. <laughs> you can count on me, little squid. I thirst for the hunt. I made some improvements to Ramesses' arcane artillery. Give the word and the sky falls on any who stand in your way. I'm in the mood to crack some skulls after that fuckery in the Temple of Baal. The City Watch will be glad to oblige me. Not sure what I have to offer a mind flare, if I'm honest. But I hope my words of encouragement and reassurance will strengthen your uh, resolve. I want my city back. And I've brought the toughest bastards from the guild to get the job done. My dark forces are at your command today. We have a common goal. All the strength of the lands we yield flows through me. And from me to you, no matter what form you take. I wouldn't miss this for all the souls in the city. Call my name, and I'll bring the hellfire. Nature's servant awaits. Glad to have you with us, and not a moment too soon. The air is thick with anticipation. All eyes are on you. They're expecting a speech. Something to stir their hearts and put fire in their bellies for the fight ahead. What will a mind flayer say that could encourage them on the threshold of battle? Prepare ourselves. We'll be ready when you call upon us. Baldurin's grace be with you. Thou need my services. If thou art ready, proceed to seal fate's image with thy final stitch. Even I was surprised by how well the owlbear would take to the potions. <laughs> Just look at it. Glorious little creature. Well, not so little anymore. 
I wouldn't be here without you. It's time I repaid the favor. Let's go, let's go! Want to bite? Been waiting a while for this. One strike for every day I spent locked in that damn pod. You have the full force of Ramazes Tower and its dashing master at your side, my friend. Let us finish this. Smells like violence all round. Smoke. Blood. Tears. <laughs> this will be a good hunt. Hurry on and start the attack. Aren't you glad you helped me into the city? <laughs> the blood baths I've enjoyed. And now, the greatest one of all. Let's go have some fun! Press on. This will all be over soon, and then... My gods, I'm having something very strong indeed. Once the city is saved, we'll rebuild it better than ever. With Iron Hand invention at its very foundation. Today, we take back the city. Don't look at me. This is your charge to lead. And no one better to do it. The sooner we get this done, the sooner we can get a pint. Assuming there's an inn still standing. Have courage, my friend. Your victory is assured. I'm glad you're here. The Illithid, too. Though it'll take some getting used to. Onwards. There is no reason to linger here. Come on. Speeches are done. All that's left is the doing. We face the greatest evil our realm has known. And we do it together. On your word, the sword of Saluna will fall upon our foes. Bodies, bloods, this is the dream. Knew I was smart to sneaks in. The skelly boy said I could stay if I sold your stuff. So hurry up. Bye, bye, bye. getting chopped up. I need customers. Don't go dying, or I'll be real mad.
Fall back! Leave him be! We have to keep running! You should come with us! It's over. He's frightened of you, but the very fact you haven't killed him on sight gives him reason to pause. Can the rumors be true? Are you the Mind Flayer who could save the city? Run, friends! Run! <laughs>